Hi, it's Martin Desjardins here in Montreal. We're actually standing in the My Land. I'm going to talk to you about the Montreal real estate market, 2013 versus 2014. At the end of 2013, we saw some hesitation in the market. Buyers were reluctant to pull the trigger. So definitely there were some less sales uh, and people were predicting that to move on into 2014. Now, predictions are starting to look a bit more positive and I have confidence that the Montreal market is gonna be decent this spring. This is always the strongest time of the year and I really feel like with interest rates being as low as they are, we even might see interest rates drop at the next call. That's going to definitely keep buyers interested and sellers are going to be able to hold the value of their property. Not expecting properties to go up dramatically, but the prices are going to hold. Maybe we're going to see some slowdowns in different areas. We're going to talk about that a little later. The scoop of the market right now, what we've seen in the last couple of weeks, are condo projects between six to 12 units, so smaller developments, not these big high rises downtown, small six to 12 units in residential areas. These units were having problems selling at the end of the year. So these developers are holding these units and are clearing them out. So we've seen some really discounted prices. If you're looking for a deal in the market, if you're looking for a condo, you just need a pied à terre, Definitely these types of units are negotiable. I've seen the proof is in the pudding. I've seen it happen in the last couple of, couple of weeks. So definitely ask your broker or give me a call and we'll go hunt some of these down. The resale market. The resale market is a local aspect. You have to always look. What's happening in the My Land for triplexes is not what's happening in Rosemount or in NDG. What's happening for houses in the My Land is not what's happening in Westmount, even Outremont or the Plateau. So you have to really get the local information. You need to have a real estate broker that's on top of it, that works these areas. And definitely you have to look at the local market, not just read the headlines and get scared that prices are going down or prices are going up. You have to really see what's happening for what you're looking for in your market. That being said, to have all the real information in the market today, we make market reports monthly. We have the percentage of asking price to sold price, all the information that a buyer or a seller could use in their transactions. Go to martinmontreal.com. You can download the market report. You can use the information. And if you have any questions, you can always contact me at clients at martinmontreal.com.